In this video, we will demonstrate how to assemble and operate the tandem Prusik belay. This belay system is consistent with CFA's low angle access, steep angle and high angle rescue systems. This video is provided for skilled maintenance and people must have received formal instruction before attempting these techniques. This video shows the process for the construction and operation of the belay. Critical safety checks must be completed before using any rope system. Ensure all equipment is laid out prior to commencing the construction of the belay. Attach the short system prusik using the triple wrap prusik hitch. Ensuring the prusik is dressed neatly. Attach the long system prusik ensuring the hitch is tied the same way as the short system prusik. The long system prusik is tied on the load side of the short prusik. Attach the 12mm steel mallion to the sling or a 25mm tube tape. Attach the short system prusik to the mallion, cinching the heat shrink onto the mallion. Attach the long system prusik and cinch the heat shrink in the same way. Tighten the mallion finger tight. There is no need to over tighten. The method used to operate the belay is known as the hitchhiker grip method. Pull the prussics away from the anchor to ensure there is no slack in the anchor sling. Hold the prussics at 90 degrees to the anchor sling. Pull a maximum of 300mm of rope vertically, then pulling back on the running end of the rope bringing the hands together. This will allow the operator to feel the amount of tension on the rope line. This also ensures that there is no slack in the belay line between the operator and the rescuer. To retrieve the belay line, simply hold the prussics with one hand and pull the belay line through. It is important to ensure there is no slack in the anchor sling and that there is a bend in the belay at the prussics. The operator should be able to hear the friction of the prussics and the belay line. In some cases where the belay line due to lengths prevents one person operation, an assistant may be used. The qualified rope operator holds the prussics ensuring no slack in the anchor sling and the assistant pulls the belay line through the prussics. Practical destruction testing of this equipment and techniques has been conducted to confirm its suitability for use within CFA. There is no risk to the operator should the belay line operate, even with the 200 kilogram load as demonstrated here. Although these tests are extreme cases, CFA chooses not to use mechanical ascenders as a general purpose rope grab. 